We're broadcasting live from outer space where no one can hear us scream. Today's game is at City Alpha Stadium. The weather conditions are cold and dark with low gravity and a 60% chance of meteorite showers. Sounds like fun. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The Snuffalo Thrills battle. The Galaxy Chaos. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. And MFL Game Day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pig flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but the, the monsoon mudslides have begun. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally cramping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. And it's first and ten. a pass and catch for a new game. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. Kaboom! And the court... Oh, the receiver has to make that catch. Now he put the team in a hole. Third down and ten. for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. here just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake it's good the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score hey speak for yourself I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring First and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. 
and that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size because he just walked all over him and it's first and ten Second down and nine. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and eight. This guy is compensating. Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. He could go all the way. He's hit the 40. The 30. The 20. The 10. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed thing, Brent. He's running from his team. First and ten. He refuses to go down. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. chance it's going to be fumbled he is fighting for every yard and he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there that's the end of quarter one well the good news is there's still time to make it a game and there's still time to get a beer and it's first and ten throw that sonic blast just cleared the and he snatches that one out of the air for a first down see if they can get something going here first and eight to go he picks up a two
Second down and six. Perfect pass and a score! point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Oh, and the ball falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Well, thank you. I do my part. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Yeah, man, I was hanging on, you know, now. You know, man. <laughs> Third down and never going to happen. Defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads up field. First and ten. The defenders want to be just kicked in. He's so fast, he can run the kick. And he's off to the races. He's at the ten. It's a touchdown. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. A nice run there for eight yards.
Second down and two. Second down in a very lot. That pass play was good for three yards. Third down and nine. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And it's first and ten. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the First and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. for six, touchdown, touchdown! Man, nobody can touch you when I'm ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. That's what you told me. dirty trick negating that play completely the offense is pissed well, i wish i had that trick in the oven with me earlier i let one whip i made a really good one win and then the doors open and the team cheerleaders get on oh, oh, that's what small talk is really put to the test in a hurry up offense there is no huddle so neither team can put their players on the bench with multiple interceptions. Oh, nice hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. There aren't too many players that get the ball lateral to his teammate we're talking street and the defense gives up five yards there second down and five second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. We're back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. <laughs> the 
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. down and five. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? And it's first and ten. The defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. First and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And then Cats will give them a 
first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that'll bring up second and one. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and one. Second down and more than the QB would like. He had it for a second there. Third down and long. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten.
third down and the punter is warming up. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. Nice catch, and he turns it on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life. In oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all you can eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Second down and seven. <laughs> Caught for the first down. Second down and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver, knocking... That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful! And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now! Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and five. for a touchdown. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. Turn the pass. <laughs> trick the last play is a race how did they do that did they go 88 miles per hour just asking touchdown oh he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey actually he does have some turkeys getting drafted on his backside from that bad burn he had last year say what come on man you can't hate with me you get my grill i'm gonna ruin your world you understand me Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for... Oh, with the brutal hit! The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second down and seven. Oh, man, I love 
this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket. He creates a sonic blast across the field to everyone but his receiver. Holy cramoli! Touchdown! And he rips off a game-breaking run for the score. Now these penalties have really gotten out of hand, especially since they're fake. Go to dirty tricks and hit a tag ref. It feels good. Second down, and he often says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. It appears that the last ref was calling his stockbroker during the huddle, and that tipped him off. It looks like he won't be buying that boat anytime soon, huh? <laughs> Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. takes their second time out hoping for a miracle. I witnessed a miracle once. A player was brought back from the dead. That's not a miracle, partner. That's just how the MFL works. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you... And no more timeouts. The D needs to stop. This is intense. No, Grim. Camping is intense. <laughs> Get it? Idiot. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move him back. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. The chaos caused defensive chaos and are the victors today. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feed of teams should get a participation award because yeah, they tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard and shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhar Corporation. They get it right every up.